vote we keep one as ABC9 pet? Can we get a panda in the ABC9 <laughs> newsroom? That's what we need. Yes. <laughs> All right. Well, Elisa, yesterday it was a pretty busy, it was a busy day at the zoo, but it was a busy day in the weather center yes. as well. But a lot of what we expected didn't end up happening. Yeah, so we did have those watches out, and uh, we did have a few strong storms, but we didn't see the tornadoes and the strong, severe storms like we thought that we did. This is uh, a tweet, a friend of mine from college, from uh, Cornell University, we studied meteorology together. Uh, we were talking about it this morning, you know, kind of what went wrong with the forecast. Here you can see this is the enhanced area, and the dots are the reports. No tornadoes, they're mostly hail, and theoretically there should be a lot of dots right there in the orange and the enhanced where we sat but what happened was you got capping inversion so what that really means is in the morning we didn't get enough sunshine as odd as that sounds the sun we needed to warm up the air rise the air create an unstable atmosphere to really feel those thunderstorms so it was cloudy in the morning so that's what really uh, didn't help our thunderstorm development so just something to learn and uh, just show how hard it really is to forecast but the one thing the cold front did do was leave us with dry, cool air behind it. A lot of dry, cool air. Beautiful day today. Clear night on the Port New Aldi Company Sky Cam HD. Temperatures were cooler than normal all day. A cooler high, only 71 degrees today. 53 was our low. And we'll be even colder than that tonight and tomorrow morning, if you could even imagine that for August. Pair fives right now in Sioux City with some clear skies. Temperatures are in the 50s and even, wow, 49 in Wayne, 54 in Tecama, some 50 still in uh, Iowa, and uh, those dew points are so dry. 47 is your dew point in Sioux City. We're even seeing some 30s earlier towards uh, South Dakota, and this is more characteristic of October. It should be around 60 in August, uh, so this is very dry and very cool. It's keeping us refreshed for August. That's thanks to a north wind, and it was pretty gusty earlier. Those have since calmed down and will continue to calm through the overnight, and that's what's going to keep us so cold. Cold. We'll clear through the overnight. 45 degrees tomorrow morning. It doesn't really feel like August when you wake up. Sunny and cool. 69 degrees by noontime. Clear on satellite and radar right now. It's thanks to high pressure. And that high pressure is going to keep our skies clear. Winds are going to calm and the air is very dry. All perfect ingredients for a very chilly night in Siouxland, which means tomorrow morning, kiddos, when you're headed for your first day of school, don't forget the jacket along with your backpack, the pencils, and all that good stuff. It's going to be chilly in the morning. Good news is we'll warm up for the afternoon to about the mid-70s. Another chilly night on Mondays. We continue with these clear skies and just dry air. But sunny through the rest of the week. That high pressure is going to stay in control of our forecast and just keep us dry. So for the first day of school, your morning bus stop, I give it a C plus because for me, 51 is too cold for August. But by the time the afternoon rolls around, beautiful. 75 degrees, an A plus day, not too hot and just gorgeous out. Lots of sunshine throughout the day. Sunny play for recess and just a beautiful afternoon, 75 degrees. So tonight you need a jacket, 45 degrees, quiet, clear, and calm. Is that a record? Almost. So our record is 42. We're forecasting 45. So Sioux City might not get it, but areas in Siouxland just might do it. 76 tomorrow, so a bit warmer than today with less wind, sunny and cool. And here's your seven-day forecast. Lots and lots of sunshine, but with those clear skies, our overnight temperatures be in the 40s. We got 48 uh, tomorrow night, so very chilly. And our next chance for some showers and storms isn't until Friday. I mean, this this spe this says fall, and mm -hmm. it is the start of the fall semester this week for We're Sioux City School. But there's still some summer left. Don't I'm, tell me that. Well, <laughs> I'm waiting to see some summer, Lisa. The uh, end of the week. The end of the week. All right, thanks so much. When we